Hello everyone, I am Toby, the Kilted Adventurer. Today we are going in search of a swimming hole. So let's go and have some fun. Today I'm back at the North Chickamauga section of the Cumberland Trail. I've taken you here during the winter. I mentioned that during the summer, one of the most popular blue holes in the area is here, the Saudi Blue Hole. So that is what we are going to see today. It should be about a mile. It includes a creek crossing. So let's go and have a lot of fun. There's the upper hogskin loop that we've looked at before. I wouldn't really dream of going up there during the summer. It's pretty rugged. In addition to that though, the poison ivy uh, probably really, really bad this time of the year. So we're gonna stick to the main trail. So the gates here open at 8 a.m. I was a little lazy this morning. Hit the snooze button one too many times, so I didn't get here till about 8.10. I was actually the third car to arrive. I don't know if they're hiking, swimming, fishing, a lot of activities out here. But if you wait till 10 or even noon, a lot of times you can't even get a parking spot in the summer. So let's go check this out. Early bird definitely gets the worm on this trail. There's a chipmunk. First good views of the creek below. Definitely a different view than when we came up here in the winter. Very nice. Right, approaching another decision point. See the arrow here. Went into the blue hole, reminding people when the gate closes, it's strictly enforced. Normally, Low hogskin loop trail. Today we are going to cross the creek. You can see the trail continues way over there. In the winter, this water is way too high to even think about crossing. I'm going to try to find mostly some rocks to step on. It doesn't look like that's going to be possible. I'll show you this view. Really beautiful in between the gorge. You can see the sun is just starting to rise over the crest. Right, this is where having waterproof boots helps. These Eddie Bowers are real troopers. So let's see if I can find the best way to cross. Made it across unscathed. You can tell I'm really starting to sweat. It's a warm day. Looking forward to finding that blue hole. I haven't been on this part of the trail in probably 25 years. It's been a lot of my youth here. I 
I didn't expect was all this rhododendron. But this is lovely in the winter. It's a nice rock. This is really special. This trail is not as easy as I remember. I've read that a lot of families come here. I've talked about wearing water shoes. Not sure how that's accomplished. I'm very happy to have a good pair of hiking boots, walking stick, plenty of water. I found it. I think I found the swimming hole. Wow. That's a rock. All right, we're going to climb this rock. See what we can see on the other side. Here's a view from the bottom. Thanks for joining me today on another hiking adventure. Remember to give me that thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and as always, seek adventure.